Hi. The tool I choose is SoundCloud. This is an audio software and I choose this tool because my sister uses it a lot and I don't know, it got my attention and I wanted to learn how it actually works. This is a distribution tool which means that you can share, you can develop and you can experience the content. Yes, you need an account. You can use your email or Facebook or Google account. Yes, there, there's a free version, but there's also two paid options. The first one is the Pro that allows you to have six hours and you have additional stats, and it costs $6 a month or $55 per year. And the second one is the Pro Unlimited, and like its name says, you have unlimited time to upload. And also you can see in which cities your listeners are, and this one is $15 per month or $135 per year. Um, three potential uses of this tool in a professional setting. I think you can use it to discover new artists. Um, you can upload audio commercials in case you're working in a big company that is targeting to new audiences. And I don't know, um, you can use it to promote yourself if you're an artist. Lately, SoundCloud seems like a very edgy, kind of cool, I mean, you don't see like big artists there. It's like DJs mixing stuff. And yeah, um, what feature is most beneficial? I think the fact that you can see, I mean, if you're using the Pro Unlimited version, that you can see where your listeners are. Yeah, I feel like this feature that you can see what every city is listening to or in which city people are listening to your music is very helpful. I mean, you can see where people are listening to you the most and where not. And Maybe you can see what are they listening to, so you can create some song or music <laughs> that will appeal to them. So I think that's a very helpful feature. What features would you recommend on what, what's missing? I don't think it's missing anything. I believe this is a very complete and useful tool for those music lovers and artists out there. And do you currently use any other tools similar to this one? Mm, which one is better and why? Mm, I don't think this one can be compared to Spotify, but they, their fu function is the same, you know, streaming music. But they are different because Spotify, I think in Spotify, I mean, it holds thousands and thousands of songs from really well-known artists and also unknown artists and you can upload music and create playlists that people can follow and listen to while in SoundCloud I believe it's like more indie, I don't know, more more yeah, more independent here anybody can upload their music and even though there are a few fake, there are a few big name artists using this platform, it's not very common. Uh, it's usually used for musicians wanting wanting to be heard. And also, I've seen a lot of DJs uploading like remix and stuff. So, yeah, which one is better? Mm, well, in my personal opinion. I believe Spotify. I mean, you can find any artists you want in any song. While in South Plan, it's like more close. I don't know how to explain it, but I feel SoundCloud. SoundCloud is like independent movies, and Spotify is like those big blockbusters. <laughs> That's like the only comparison I can think right now. So, yeah. I'm done.